Hello my planner pals and welcome back and if you're new here then thank you for joining me and giving me a try. My name is Di, I am here at Creative Karma Design. Today we are talking about my wellness planner and how I am adapting and changing my wellness planner. When I did my lineup I kind of left it as long as I could because I wasn't sure whether I wanted to try and incorporate my wellness planner in with my weekly dashboard, my catch-all planner. And I figured that I just can't. I can't, I don't have enough space to put everything that I want into there and put all the workouts in and track my vitamins and all of the stuff, the self-care stuff. So I'm just like, I need a wellness planner. And what I did for December was I started using it a little bit differently. And I started using the currently page to track the workouts and just take things back to ba basics. Like, I think I mentioned this in a previous video, but just doing some kind of aerobic kind of cardiovascular workout, a balance workout, because again, I'm still trying to rehab my kneecap, some calisthenics, and that might change to weights as we move further into the year, but not yet. And then some kind of stretch or yoga. And this worked really, really well for my currently page. I have stuck to this and I just literally like today is a stretch day. Tomorrow will be aerobics. The day after will be balanced. Then it'll be the, the strength training workout. So it just kind of cycles around and... I just literally do one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And if I skip a day, I don't skip that, that workout. I just do it the day after. So that has been working great. And then for my monthly, I decorated this knowing that I wanted to put something in the little boxes. And all I've been doing is I just put here, increase workouts to 12 minutes. And again, aerobics balance, calisthenics stretch, 12 minutes a day. Um, and rotate through each day. Again, calisthenics, stretch, aerobics, balance, calisthenics, stretch, aerobics, balance. I just kind of kept cycling through. I missed two days here, and that is my goal. I can't miss more than one day, so I can't do a two-day stretch. I can miss one day, but I can't miss two. So that has been the goal this week, this month, and it has been working beautifully, beautifully. So that is what I want to continue as we move into 2024. And I mentioned this in a different video, but Rini and I are kind of challenging each other. And if you want to join in, you can join in. But we are challenging each other to do a different focus or a different challenge or a different theme each month. But this really helped me kind of get back to some kind of basics. And here's the one thing that I will say that I noticed I have an app on my phone that does um, interval workouts, so I can set it up to 45 seconds of work and then 15 seconds of rest. And I just literally set that up for 12 of those repetitions, and that's all I do. I can't, do, I can't count and work out at the same time. I have discovered that about myself. I can't count and work out at the same time. So I literally do all of these for 45 seconds, each one, and the stretch is the same. I just do them for 45 seconds and then I've got 15 seconds to just kind of cycle through, go to the next thing or get to the floor, stand up, get a resistance band, whatever it is. And that is working so well, so well. Now, my weekly, my weekly, I have been adding a box in for the workouts. I love this. I love adding a box in for the workouts. This has been my tracking for a while. I like the middle bit to be my food tracking, even though I can't remember what I had there. But yes, what I think I'm going to do, um, either depending on where I put my, my workout box, either down here or up here, I think I need some kind of checklist. So what I did for this week was I put a little checklist in of things that I needed to do. And that's what I want to do some more of. Because if I can come in and checklist something, I might be more motivated to write in it. And I know I haven't written in much in this, but we just had a busy week. It's my birthday and all of that. But yes, I think that is my goal. Some kind of checklist of self-care, taking my vitamins. Did I hit my water intake? Did I sleep well? All of that kind of stuff. So that is my goal as we head into 2024. 
each month I'm going to come in, use my currently page, and you can see that I've kind of already started thinking about this. Use the currently page as my workouts. What did I, what was what was the meat of my workout? Three priorities, and then appointments and stuff in here, and then my monthly. I will do the challenge, which is going to be jumpstart January. And then the weeklies here will be tracking. I will have some kind of box for the workout for the day, a little checklist, and then maybe one of the boxes for symptoms and stuff like that and feelings and stuff. I'm also thinking I'm starting to track my personal development stuff in here, um, like what books I'm reading, et cetera, et cetera. So that is the plan. And what I thought I would do for the rest of this video, because otherwise it'd be a very short video and very boring, was I'm going to share with you what I am doing for January. And because I want it to match this, I'm thinking of using some green, some green stuff for it to match, for it to match. So I am going to, I am going to, I put my, my stuff in here, my important stuff, Manny Petty twice a month, facial, that's a home facial, twice a month, hair cut and color, and then a day off of keto. Those are my one, two, three, four, five, six, seven things there. So what I thought I was going to do was just put in, I've got some washi dots. So I'm just gonna put in some washi dots in a similar color. I think, yeah, that one. And we're literally just gonna put that in there. This is the first time that I've been using this new layout for the currently page, and I kind of like it. I think it's way better than the old one. So I'm going to do Manny Petty here, and then we'll do a little checkbox. That makes sense. We'll do facial here, little checkbox, and then we'll do haircut and color here, and a little checkbox. Or I could just do two. Yeah, let's just do two. Let's just do two. That makes more sense, doesn't it? Yeah, let's just do that. Nothing saying I can't do that. Okay, there we go. That's not straight, but we're going to go with it. Okay, and then that goes in there. So that's fat. This I'm just going to write in. That's fine. And then I've got my workouts here. What I thought I was just going to do was, I mean, I've just literally written them out on post-it notes, but though it kind of bothers me that that's going to have to go over there, but was just use these. These are the little post-its, the little sticky notes from the, the Happy Planner book. I was like either those or or like these, but I don't think I have enough in that color, in that colorway. Yeah, it's a different green look. It's a different green. It's not wintry enough. It is not wintery enough. And I only have that one in that size. Yep, we're just going to use those. I don't need a bunch of stuff. I don't need a bunch of stuff. But what I might do is put a little bit of washi in. I've been using It's funny. I got this. I got this in the mystery box. And I really didn't think I would use it as much as I am. I think I'm going to use this one. I know it's got the blue in, but I kind of like it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Oh, see, now I've seen that one. No, that's not even the same color. I can't even. Can't even, but I feel like I need something just to, hmm. Yeah, just to. So why don't you let me know what health goals you have for 2024, if any. And like I said, the the challenge that Rini and I are doing for January is basically jumpstart. And basically it is to get back to healthy habits, which mine are here. And they are to get back on my hydration because I have been absolutely terrible. Terrible. Like I can't, oh, it's not even the boy to the edge. I can't even how bad I have been lately. So get back onto hydration. To ice or do some kind of massage on my foot. 
my feet have been terrible. I used to have, when I was running, I used to have self, I used to have um, plantar fasciitis pretty bad at one point, and it has come back with vengeance. It has come back with vengeance. So I need to start icing my feet again. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know I might put a little bit down the bottom as well now. It never ends. And because I don't need that bit, I'm going to cover that up in a minute. I think if I can get some more very thin washi like this, I would like it in more colours. I love that thin washi. Okay, what else was I doing? See, now I'm like, do I want to do boxes? I was going to do something else and I've forgotten what it is. I can't even with my brain. Do I want to do those boxes? I just don't know that it can fit everything in one of those boxes. I could try. I could try. I need to wipe that bit. Oh, I was wiping that bit out. That's what I was doing. Thank you for the reminder. <laughs> if you reminded me what the hell I was doing. We don't need that. I just don't know if I can get all of that in there. I don't think I can. I'm being optimistic, but I don't think I can. Um, let's just put that in. You think? Yes. Let's just put these in. It doesn't have to be fantastic. It just needs to freaking work. It just needs to work, die. And then we've got two, three, and four. We could just do that. Yeah, that'll work. That'd work, that'd work, that'd work. Let's put the end one in first. So the, my other, wow, I, I just got totally sidetracked there. My other habit that I want to do is I want to try mouth taping. I am, I was just talking to Rini about this, I am a mouth breather at night time. I always have been. I used to struggle when I was a kid with allergies and stuff. And I've always been a mouth breather. And I was reading about, you know, I know it's bad for you, but when you struggle, you struggle. And when I was doing yoga regularly, I became better at breathing through my nose. And then the pandemic happened. I stopped teaching yoga as much and here we are. Yeah, that's all I need. That's all I need for that. That is all I need. So I think I'm going to just write in, if I can find a pen, write in here. I start off with aerobics, then I do balance, and then I do um, calisthenics. I never know whether that's one L. I think I'm going to do one. Not that it matters. And then we do stretch. Flash yoga. Okay. And then I've been doing, I started last month doing 10 minutes. I've then bumped it up to 12. Next, next, um, next month, I'm going to go to 15. And because I, yeah, because I want two different ones here. I'm going to give myself the opportunity to do the stationary bike as an option for the aerobics. And these are all 15 minutes. A little, a little doodad at the bottom. And this is what I want to start doing more of with you guys is, um, oops, S on the end of there, is more of a actual plan with me, right, rather than just decorating. I'm going to do this first before I forget. Um, money, petty. I know you're looking at my fingers right now going, what the frick die? Um, it is pouring down with rain right now in Southern California. And if you could see my clothes right now, because I had a puppy, 
a mucky puppy jumping all over me. And let me tell you, I'm covered in mud. I am covered in mud. I might put those as two different things. Haircut and hair color. I actually do my own. I actually do my own at home. Day off keto. Okay, that's that. That's all of those done. And then this... You know what I might find is a little sticker to go in there. Where would I find that? Here. There's these. Yeah. Oh my god, that actually fits the colour scheme. That actually fits the colour scheme. Look at that. Yes. Hydrate. Eight glasses of water each day i'm gonna put a little thing to what are they called fizzy waters i've gotten into the habit of drinking the fizzy water again and i need to get back <laughs> not that that's a euphemism for anything but i need to get back to actually doing water water that actually fits as well i'm gonna put that in Maybe down there. Just looking through the book now. Hang on. I just feel like I want to put something in there. So that's going there. Yeah, okay. And then... I'm not sure about this one now. Um, five Min's Ice Slash Self Maya Fascial Release on Feet Daily. And that's something that I'll track on my monthly and my weekly. And then here, I'm going to put try mouth taping to sleep. Perfect. And then I'm going to put these in here. So again, what I've been doing is um, like a 15 minute workout is my plan each day. Okay, and that, I'm just going to put that in there because why not? It does need something. I just need something. That is my currently page set up. Again, I think we sometimes get caught up in the, the prettiness. Sometimes all you need is some washi, a couple of stickers, and you're good. Because this not only matches this, which is, this is my goal for the next year, is that this seasonal planner helps me to use my stickers and my stash. Um, especially stuff like the washi dots and stuff like that. But I have everything that I need here. Priorities, water, ice and self-myofascial release, try a mouth, mouth taping, mani-pedi, facials, hair cut, hair color, day off of keto, that's my aerobics workout. I've got two choices here. Balance workout, calisthenics, stretch. And again, I just do timed. I do 15 seconds. No, I do 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. And I use the app interval timer. But yeah, that is my plan for January. And again, I'll be back at some point to decorate this and share with you how I'm going to use this as a tracking for it question mark um but yeah again it'll probably be the same as this i'll just put my workouts in that's the, i think that's the plan these will have the workouts in and a little checklist for the icing i think that will be the plan but yes let me know um what your health and wellness goals are for 2024 and you know how have you been, been doing with your habits let me know in the comments down below i hope you enjoyed this if you did give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you're not already and i will see you next time my planner pals Bye. Helps if you press record. <laughs> it helps if you press record. I just need to fill that 
space in. I just need to fill the space in and I can't help myself. I'm literally just shoving things that are a similar colour vibe. I think that's enough. All right, now I'm done. Bye. <laughs>